I'm Caitlin Pulcher. I'm an actuarial science major and I'm a junior. And you both have several managers working under you, so I was wondering what are some steps that a new entrant into the job market can take to accelerate their journey towards an upper level management position? Yeah, well, one thing I will tell you that I didn't realize when I was getting out of school is how much the unusual person will jump out at you. I mean, you know, and, and it isn't because they got 200 IQs or anything like that. It, it's really because of just how they behave, you know, what they bring, the energy they bring, the commitment they bring, the quality of how they do things, how they treat the people around them, all kinds of things. But uh, you will jump out much more than you might anticipate. One of the things you would want to be sure to do uh, is, whether you like it or not, get very comfortable, it may take a while, with public speaking, for example. I mean, that, that's a, an asset that will last you 50 or 60 years, and it's a liability if you don't like doing it and are uncomfortable doing it, that also will last you 50 or 60 years, and it's a necessary skill. But a lot of the skills are just human skills. If you get the best out of people around you, that's a rare talent, and it, it, doesn't, it doesn't correlate with IQ. It correlates with a, you know, an attitude and a, toward the world and toward other people. And it's a talent that if you work at early and you're really conscious about it, you, know, you don't have to show up other people. You, know, you don't have to be smarter than they are or anything else. You want to bring out the best in them. It will pay huge dividends.